good morning friends and my dear colleagues now today we learn the subject is so fundamental of software development and the subject code is 3341603 now the unit name is software development process now in that we learn the topic of software definition of software characteristics of software software maths and other topics now i am presenting by myself hardik pes patel lecturer in computer engineering vpmp polytechnic now the first is objective first topic 1.1 software in that definition and characteristics and 1.2 software maths now what is software software is the collection of computer programs procedures rules associated documents and concerned data with the operation of data processing system it also includes representation of pictorial video and audio information in that software there are two types one is a system software and second is a application software now what is system software it is responsible for controlling integrating the hardware component of a system so the software and the users can work with them now best example of system software is operating system second is a application software it is used to accomplish some specific task it should be collection of small programs like example microsoft word excel powerpoint etc next is a software characteristics the software characteristics of a software decide whether the software is good or bad now this is a very most important characteristics first is understandability software should be easy to understand it should be efficient to use second is a cost software should be cost effective as per its usage then third maintainability software should be easily maintainable and modifiable in future then next modularity software should have a modular approach so it can be handled easily for testing next is a functionality software should be functionally capable to meet user requirements next reliability it should have the capability to provide failure free service then portability software should have the capability to be adapted for different environment now what kind of different environment like if uh, software works in a windows linux and other operating system so it is feasible for for this software to run on that environment next is a correctness software should be correct as per its requirements then next is a documentation software should be properly man documented so that we can re refer it in the future then also reusability it should be reusable or its code or logic should be reusable in a future then next interoperability software should be able to communicate with various devices using standard bus structure and the protocol next is a next topic is a software doesn't wear out this is the typical word like software doesn't wear out but here there is a failure curve arise in that failure curve there are two ways hardware failure curve and second software failure curve uh, and this failure curve is depends on the time and failure rate now in this figure the relationship between 
टाइम एंड फेलर कॉल्ड ए बाथ टब कव वॉट इट कैन बाथ टब कव इट इंडिकेट्स दैट हार्डवेर एक्सिबिट्स रिलेटिवली हाई फेलर रेट्स early in its life then defects are corrected and the failure rate drops to a steady state level for some period of time now as the time passes the failure rate rises again as a hardware component suffer from the effects of dust vibration temperature extremes and many other environmental factors so simply we can say hardware begins to wear out now second is a software failure go it is also same like time and failure rate the above figure shows the software failure rate now software is not highly affected by environmental effect yes it's fact in the early stage due to many errors software could have high failure but it becomes reliable as time passes instead of wearing out once software is made it has a longer life span in actual curve we can see that software may have increased failure rate as they may become obsolete as the environment in which it was developed or it was changes spike in the curve if due to chance of maintenance and side effects not from the environmental so the software may be retired due to the new requirement yes software will may be retired due to new technology new environment new requirement new generation so software doesn't wear out but it may be deteriorate deteriorate next topic is software is engineered not manufactured like hardware once a product is manufactured it is not easy to modify it while in case of software we can easily change or modify or change it for later use even making multiple copies of software is a very easy task rather it is much more tough in case of hardware in hardware costing is due to assembly of raw material and other processing expenses while in software development no assembly needed like hardware so software is not manufactured as it is developed or it is engineered now the 1.2 software maths software is easy to change outsourcing of software to a third party can relax the customers software can work right from the first time increase the software reliability will increase the software safety reusing software increase safety best software is one which has more features testing of software will remove all errors once the project is working job is done like once the software is completed or software working in working condition so all job is done so thank you for all of you